I'd like to introduce you to the Sunvision Cyclone Nano. This is a fantastic multimedia player device which also has Android 2.3 operating system on board. That's the same thing that you find on a lot of Android tablets and it means that alongside playing your music, your films and your pictures, you can also browse the web, check your emails, get online with your social networking and download the masses of apps that are available all from the comfort of your sofa in front of your TV. The package comes with Sunvision's AirMove controller device which is a full QWERTY sized keyboard and a mouse setup and that means that you can access all of these features in the same way that you would on a computer. The device has 2GB of internal storage, this is expandable with an SD card and it will also read off USB memory sticks. It's a great little device, we'll spend a little bit of time looking at all the features and then we'll have a look how it actually works on a TV. So this is the device out of the box. You can see that there's two different versions. There is a slimline version and a larger version, but both of these are exactly the same once they're plugged into the TV. They are quite small devices and they come with a range of accessories to help you get started. First of all, you'll find the AirMove controller, a power cable, you'll get an HDMI cable and the larger device because it's got the extra space has room for a normal AV connector set. Taking a look at each of the devices in a bit more detail the front of the slimline device has got just three status lights including a network status connection light it's got the IR receiver for a controller. Connections are on the side of the device there's a micro SD and two USB ports on the other side you've got two more USBs, the HDMI and the power in and power button. The larger device has a power button on the front, the IR receiver for the controller, there's an SD and MMC card slot, there's three status lights again with the network status and two more USB ports. There's no connectors on the side of the device this time but turning a box around you can see that there is a power supply, a special slot for the AV connectors, your HDMI connection and we've also got the wired Ethernet connector here as well. This is a closer look at the AirMove controller. It's got all the QWERTY keys or your letter keys. The middle section has the two mouse buttons, that's a left and right mouse button and also along the top are a set of function keys which actually include your play, pause and skip buttons for music and videos. The interface will be familiar to anyone who's used Android before. Using the file system viewer, this is a selection of pictures that I've got. They display very nicely on the screen and you can also very easily set up a slideshow. Videos play with one of two different apps. Again, they look crisp and clear. Your music system also has a full categorization system dividing by artist or album. And when you play a track, the album art comes up in the background. There is also a very good web browser on the device. It works quite quickly. You can see here I've selected the 3000 RPM website and although it's a little slower than it might be on your home computer it does load up very quickly and it looks exactly as it would normally appear. So that was the Sunvision Cyclone Nano, the slim and the full-size versions. These are fantastic multimedia playing devices and they also do all of the things that an Android operating system could do. Check out the website for more details and visit us on Facebook.